but we're going to also use some salt to spice it up a bit. It's true. So we can begin. See. For that, we're going to need some uh, paintbrushes, water paints, water obviously, and some salt. regular water paints. They're using some water and the paints. And you can be free to do whatever you want. Paint the way you want. Abstract paint, something more the uh, I don't know. Your face. A flower. The face of Christine. The face of Joanna. The face of Alessandro. My face. Oh. <laughs> Judith's face. Judith's face. And while the paint is still wet, and this you need to do with a lot of water, yeah. and if you like something you do, you need to add some salt. And this is very important, guys. While this is still wet, is where it is the right moment to put the salt. Because the salt will absorb the water and the color with it and make some interesting new patterns. And when the your painting is again dry, you can just uh, rub the salt gently off of it, throw it away or put it in a jar for a decoration and see what is the result. Yes. It will be a surprise because it will take time now to, to dry. So I think that uh, guys, you have really to do this so you can see the last uh, result. result.